I was gonna wait to start filming until tomorrow morning, but I'm home alone. I have not smoked weed today, which is great. Good job on me for doing that. Woo, I'm doing it. But I am sort of losing my mind. Could be because I haven't eaten today. Probably is because I haven't eaten today. Well, no, that's not true. I had a bagel and I had chicken pot pie. So I did eat today, but not too much, which is why I'm making mac and cheese. Old reliable, mac and cheese is always good. I wanted to make something else, but you don't have the income coming in anymore. Oh my goodness. I can hear that it's boiling, so we should probably put the mac and cheese in there. So the first thing you'll need for mac and cheese is mac and cheese. And the next thing you'll need is to put it in there. Don't forget this step, it's very important. Ow, ow, ow. Got it. First, you have to mutilate your mac and cheese box. Dump this, then we'll stir it out. And then we'll set a little timer for like, I'm gonna do six because I don't want it to be overcooked. Anyway, let me climb back on the counter while our mac and cheese is waiting and cooking and hanging out. I just thought I'd turn the camera on and talk a bit. If you've seen my previous videos that I've been putting out, you know that I am trying to quit weed. And it's day one again. It's been day one for like the last four months, but that's okay, I have a pretty strong feeling that I'm not gonna smoke tonight because one, I don't have weed. And two, it would be really hard to go get weed. I don't even know how I would do that right now because dispensaries are closed and I'd literally have to go rob someone and I'm not gonna do that. No, I'm not gonna do that. Let's say hi to Mercury, everyone say help him. Everybody would say hi to Mercury. Mercury. He's always trying to headbutt the camera. Say hi to the people. <laughs> he looks mad, but I promise he's not mad. He's actually a very sweet boy. Look, he wants to lay in my lap. Now lay down. Lay your butt down. Good job. That's some good cuddles. What do you think, Mercury? Any thoughts? All right, well, I'm gonna finish the mac and cheese. I'm gonna eat it. I'm gonna watch Succession. I'm gonna go to bed. Seems pretty straightforward. I don't think there's any way I can fuck this up, so see you bitches in the morning. Hello? I have something to show you. Hello? Look, what is that? What is that? And it's back. Damn. Bring it back. Uh, good morning. I'm awake. I got my coffee. Let's have a chat. I woke up at like 6, which does not happen for me. At least not any time recently, so that's pretty cool. But I woke up from a nightmare, so that's not pretty cool. Felt pretty horrible waking up, but now that I've had time to marinate and wake up, I'm feeling a little better. Currently reading this book right now. It's the second book of this series, really good. Highly recommend it. Although I'm on page like 10, so. I haven't gone on my phone yet this morning. That's a new thing I'm trying out. Loving that. Yeah, but overall I'm feeling good. So, I just accidentally bought a coconut, so I'm gonna give you a taste test. I don't know why, I really didn't want a coconut, but they were like, do you want a coconut? And I felt bad, so I bought a coconut. I don't even really like coconut water. It like makes me want to throw up a little, but it's like super refreshing. I just hiked twice, like the same hike, but I did it twice for some reason. So, this is what I need right now. Can't really make up my mind about it. I would say it's more good than not. So thanks to the coconut people at the coconut stand. I like it a little.
I don't know how to do that. Just, like, where do I go? Didn't teach me that in school. And mommy and daddy aren't answering the phone. So let's investigate. I don't even know what that means. My tire might be flat. Let's look. Just investigated and it looks fine. So I'm gonna pretend it's fine. And if it's not fine, I'll find out when my car fucking blows up. Anyway, how are you guys doing? How's your day? I forgot to check in with you. Oh god. Something about being in the world, just like being in public, really stresses me out. Maybe it's just because I live in LA and there's something kind of performative about living here. I don't know. It's different. It's different. It's not like New York where everyone's just sort of doing their own fucking thing. No one gives a fuck. Here, it feels like everyone's judging you and that might not be true, you know? I mean, honestly, no one probably does give a fuck, but it feels like they do, and it feels like they're going to be mean to me about it. So I'm just kind of on edge when I'm out in the world, especially when I'm holding a little video camera like this. Like, oh, I'm the stupid guy in my car with a camera. I'm the YouTuber, but I don't give a fuck. Clearly, I do, actually, because I just talked about it for a while, but I'm trying not to give a fuck, and it's hard. It's hard not to give a fuck. Unless it isn't. How do I end this? How do I get out of here? Do we like this hat more, or should I get a different hat? Oh my gosh, have you guys seen my Stitch hat yet? I don't think you have. One second. I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. I feel like shit today. I don't feel good. I'm definitely experiencing symptoms of depression and anxiety. I think I am at least, I don't really know. But that's what it feels like it is. I don't know, today just feels tough. I have a bit of a headache and that's normal. I mean, I watched some videos about like what to expect when quitting weed and I expected to feel like this. This is no surprise, but it's still like, damn, this fucking sucks. It just makes me not want to do anything, you know? But let's not be negative, okay? Let's not be entirely negative. Are there any upsides to this? Can't think of many, but it's day three. That's an upside, you know? The past year and a half, I've smoked almost every day, so this is the first time I've gone three days. I just hope it gets better from here on out because I feel like I need a nap indefinitely until the end of the day. You know what, that's actually a good idea. Just kidding, I'm not actually gonna take a nap, okay? Don't freak out, it's just a joke. I don't know, to be honest, I don't know if I have much for you guys today. Like, what I, I'm not just gonna sit on camera all day and be like, this shit sucks, I hate my life, I don't want to be alive. I wish I had more to say, but I feel like I've said it all. I guess this is where we leave things. I wish the ears were like permanently up, like burr, but they're like burr, so. All right, well, I will talk to you motherfuckers later.